So Cookie Run Kingdom is giving away 671 cookie cutters for you. All you got to do is max promote every single cookie to five stars. So that absolutely means that you should go right up and punch your grandma, steal her pocketbook, and then obviously spend all of her money in the game till you can max out every single cookie. Now, obviously, I don't think you should go punch your grandma and steal her pocketbook because let's be honest, she probably can't really take a punch, but maybe your sister could. I'm just kidding, guys. In all honesty here, Cookie Run Kingdom just dropped a brand new event in game that essentially is rewarding us for max promoting five star units. And I'm going to tell you guys right now, it's kind of greedy. Diving right in, as you can see, we're in the new section for Cookie Run Kingdom. We're underneath the new update and new bonuses section. It says, excited about the new update? Well, we've prepared some extra rewards you might find to your liking. Read this announcement and prepare yourself to enjoy the new content to the fullest. Starting us off here for event number one, we've got get rewards for each five-star cookie. The duration is going to last from now all the way through the update dropping on July 7th. As the rewards are going to be promoting your cookies to five star before the update maintenance on July 7th and receive special cookie cutters for the number of five star cookies you have. So pretty straightforward here. Essentially, we're getting bonus cookie cutters, special cookie cutters to be exact for every five star promotion you have. And not only that, based on your cookies rarity, you're going to be getting an additional amount of cutters. Starting us off here, as you can see, we've got common special cookie cutters type times three rares we've got special cookie cutters times five we got epic and special going to be getting special cookie cutters times 10 super epic cookies are going to be getting special cookie cutters times 15 and then ancient and legendaries are going to be getting special cookie cutters times 20 and just to reiterate here this is only counting five star promoted cookies not cookies that you could five star, not cookies that you haven't five starred, but only cookies that at the time of the July 7th update, when it drops and this event comes to an end, are already five star promoted. That's all that's going to count to award you special cookie cutter. Some important things here we've got receive reward depends on the number of five star cookies you have by July 7th. For example, if you have 14 rare cookies at a five-star promotion, you will then receive 70 special cookie cutters. So essentially, for every rare cookie that you have at a five-star promotion, you're going to be getting yourself five special cookie cutters. And because for this example, we have 14 max at five-star, then 14 times five is going to give us 70 special cookie cutters. And then as it says down here as well, it says you must have... The cookies promoted to five star in order to receive the reward. Having the soul stone equivalent to five stars will not count towards the event. And then the reward will be delivered after the update maintenance via your mailbox. And that's essentially it, guys. That's all you need to know about the brand new promotion thing. I mean, you get in here between now and July 7th. Max promote as many cookies as your account possibly allows you to do so. So then you guys can claim the free additional special cookie cutters. And not only that, you should be doing it anyway for the overall bonds i know there's a lot of players that are currently sitting on enough soul stones like the full amount to five star cookies they just haven't spent the gold for whatever reason to actually five star max promote them because they're not simply using them well right now is the perfect time to do so claim these additional free special cookie cutters however would i honestly to answer the question that i've seen already through the community is it worth spending money to do so? I'm going to probably honestly say no. I don't think that it's worth opening your wallet and spending any additional money in order for you guys to, you know, five star promote additional cookies to get these cookie cutters. Because let's just be honest, guys. Cookie cutters are fantastic for doing summons, but we already get an abundance of them from, you know, various sources in the game. And not only that, they're not giving away crystals, which in my opinion are a lot more valuable than the overall cutters and would warrant, in my opinion, somebody spending versus, you know, somebody not spending. So you guys let me know your thoughts are down below. As always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe here on the channel for everything Cookie Run Kingdom related. And with that being said, though, guys, as always, I'll see you on the next one.